Did you know that bananas are berries, but strawberries aren't? It's a strange fact, isn't it? But it's no tall tale or internet hoax. In the botanical world, things are not always as they seem. You see, what we commonly identify as berries in our everyday language doesn't quite sync up with the scientific definition. And that's where the banana, our beloved yellow fruit, makes its surprising entrance. Bananas, with their thick, protective skin and fleshy insides, qualify as berries according to botanists. Meanwhile, the strawberry, that quintessential berry we all know and love, doesn't make the cut. It's a shocking twist, isn't it? This is just the tip of the iceberg lettuce, which, by the way, isn't an iceberg, nor a lettuce. But we'll save that for another video. So, as we peel away the layers of this botanical conundrum, one question remains. Now, aren't you curious why bananas, of all things, are classified as berries? In the botanical world, a berry is a fleshy fruit produced from a single ovary. This definition, while scientifically accurate, can be quite surprising, especially when we consider our everyday understanding of what a berry is. So, let's dissect this a little. Botanists, the scientists who study plants, have a very specific definition of a berry. It's a type of fruit where the entire pericarp, that's the part of the fruit derived from the ovary, is fleshy. And guess what? A banana fits this description perfectly. It's a fruit born from a single ovary, and its entire structure, from its heart to its skin, is fleshy. But here's the twist. Our everyday use of the word berry doesn't always match up with the botanical definition. That's why when we stroll down the produce aisle, we might not think of bananas as berries. Yet, botanically speaking, they are. So, bananas are berries, but what about strawberries? Strawberries, despite their name, do not meet the botanical criteria for a berry. Now, you might be wondering, how is that possible? Well, let's delve into the world of strawberries. Botanically, a berry is a fruit derived from the ovary of a single flower, with seeds embedded in the flesh. The strawberry, however, is a bit of an oddball. It's an aggregate fruit, which means it forms from multiple ovaries of a single flower, each of which becomes a tiny fruit called an achene. Those tiny yellow dots on the surface of a strawberry? Those are the actual fruits. So why do we call strawberries berries? It's all down to common language usage. In culinary contexts, we classify fruits based on taste and texture. So strawberries got lumped in with berries. So next time you reach for a banana or a strawberry, you'll know exactly what you're eating. A berry and a, well, not a berry.